good morning in today's session we'll take some problems based on solenoid in the last class if we can recall we have learned how to find out the magnetic field at the center of a solenoid based on that we'll do some sums first take down this question a solenoid of length 0.5 meter has a radius of 1 cm and is made up of 500 turns made up of 500 turns it carries a current of 5 ampere it carries a current of 5 ampere what is the magnitude of magnetic field magnitude of the magnetic field what is the magnitude of the magnetic field inside the solenoid now first let us read this here as we are given with a solenoid of length 0.5 meter and has a radius of 1 centimeter the length of the solenoid is 0.5 meter whereas its radius is 1 centimeter so i can say that the length is more when compared to its radius so i can use here the formula which i have derived for long solenoid and given that it's me the number of turns is 500 turns the current is also given now what is the magnitude of the magnetic field inside the solenoid so first we will write the given things so here given length of the solenoid is 0.5 meter then number of turns is 500 current in the solenoid current is 5 amperes then we have to kind it what is the magnetic field B now we can say that the length is very large when compared to its radius and hence we can use the formula for long solenoid so the magnetic field inside the solenoid is given by the formula is b is equal to if you can recall it as mu naught into ni b is b is mu naught into ni So first we should know what is n here in this equation n is number of turns per unit length so n is number of turns per unit length or it is calculated as number of turns divided by length the number of turns given is 500 and the given length is 0.5 this will be equal to 1000 now i is given mu naught also we know therefore b is mu naught that is 4 pi into 10 raised to the power minus 7 multiplied by n multiplied by current phi this will be equal to calculate this it comes to around 6.28 multiply by 10 raised power minus 3 tesla 
सिक्स पॉइंट टू एट इंटू टेन राइज पावर माइनस थ्री टेस्ला दैट कंप्लीट दैट प्रॉब्लम नाउ विल टेक डाउन एन अदर वन ए क्लोजली बाउंड सोलोनाइड A closely wound solenoid, eight centimeter long. Sorry, eighty centimeter, not eight centimeter. Eighty centimeter long. Has five layers of windings. Has five layers of windings of four hundred tons each. Of four hundred tons each. The diameter of the solenoid is one point eight centimeter. Diameter of the solenoid is one point eight centimeter. If the current carried is eight amperes. estimate estimate the magnitude of b b magnitude of b inside the solenoid near its center inside the solenoid near its center Now let us read. We are given with a solenoid whose length is eighty centimeter, and it has five layers of four hundred tons each. So total number of tons will be four hundred tons multiplied by five layers. The diameter of the solu uh, solenoid is one point eight centimeter. If the current is eighty ampere, find out what is the magnitude of the magnitude of the magnetic field at the center of the solenoid. So first, well, let us write the given things. Length of the solenoid. Length is eighty centimeter. Five layers of four hundred tons each, and then we have current as eighty amp eight amperes. The for total number of tons will be. Total number of tons will be five layers multiplied by each layer has four hundred tons. This will be equal to two thousand tons. Now the magnitude of the magnetic field is given by B is equal to. We know it is mu naught n into i. Magnetic field at the center is given by magnetic field at the center B is mu naught into n into i. So what is n? It is Number of turns per unit length. Number of turns divided by length. Number of turns is it is two thousand turns divided by length. Length is eighty centimeter. Convert it into meter. This will become equal to. Two thousand five hundred tons per unit length. Two thousand five hundred tons. Therefore, B is four pi into ten to the power minus seven. That is value of mu naught into n. N is two thousand five hundred. 
substitute the values in this equation mu naught is 4 pi into 10 to the power minus 7 into 2500 that is the uh, number of turns per unit length multiplied by 8 now calculate this and uh, this will be the value in tesla just calculate and then you write down the value of magnetic field in tesla here one thing we have to remember is uh, we have assumed uh, when we derived this equation we have assumed that the solenoid is very long that is its radius is less when compared to the length of the solenoid the magnetic field at the center here it is coming as 25.13 into 10 to the power minus 3 tesla so it is 4 pi into 1 exponential 10 in into 10 to the power minus 7 multiplied by 2500 multiplied by 8 that will give you 0 0.025 tesla point tesla point zero two five tesla or it can also be written as equal to 25.1 into 10 rise power minus 3 tesla that completes the problem